Okay, here we are in this beautiful image, and I have to tell you that it's gotten better. This is the one I did that I said it's probably the best, closest SNES, NES Classic clone that I've ever seen. You even had the NES Classic Edition collection, Super Famicom collection, Super Nintendo collection, and the Family Computer Disk System collection. So not only is it cool like that, and you got the classics, uh, but it's running the SNES Ruckage theme. You got the same sound effects. You can add the background music if you want. I think it actually comes with that. I think I disabled it. And then lastly, there's a new, the author of this DMC has offered up a brand new intro video that I think really sets this apart. I wouldn't make an entire video about this if I didn't think it was worth showing you guys. You know, I really think it went all about from start to finish. You get your custom case, Nest Pi case, whatever it is. You get the right SD card for you. You get the right theme, music. Everything's custom, right? So let's make it even a little more custom. We're going to change out the intro video to his custom intro video. He, I want to give props to him. I'll put a link to, to this. He is offering it up for download. So thank you very much. And uh, I'm sure there'll be links in the description below. But to get started, you just need to get on the internet. I'm going to connect to Wi-Fi over here. You can just plug it in though as well. I just go to Wi-Fi and type in the password. All right, once you're on the Wi-Fi, go ahead and keep your Pi on and just move over to your computer. All right, once you're turned on your computer, you should see your Pi. There you go, right there, Retro Pi. Go over to Splash Screens. And here you go. Here are all your Splash Screens. These all, delete, enter. You can back them up if you want. Paste in your file here. And then as I mentioned, there's a link in the description below. The file is called pi space SNES space mini space intro dot mp4. And because this is on the Wi-Fi, it's gonna go a little slow. You can also transfer this via USB. All right, and now you can see we have the video there. You can even double click it and it should work. It's just really slow over the network. Remember that, but there you go. So it's in there now. We can go ahead and close out of the computer and just restart our pi and it should work. And here we are back in the image. As you can still see, see still beautiful. Um, the, the, the intro splash screen goes perfectly with this. As I mentioned before, it was already really awesome and it just got even more awesome. If you want, you can leave all those other splash screens in there and just have it rotate between all of them. Um, but it's that easy because the splash screens were already set to go. You just, you could just either drop and, and drop new ones, take some out, the, the choice is all yours. I hope you enjoyed this one. Like I said, it's one of my favorites. Shout out to DMC on this one. He did an awesome job and it just got awesomer. Let me know if you guys have any questions, comments, concerns, whatever. Don't forget to like and subscribe if you could and we'll catch you on the next one.